I'm Bear Grylls. This week, I'm stuck at home. I'll be facing extreme boredom, dwindling supplies, and the maddening effects of isolation. Okay, so I've been here for just over a week now and things are getting rough. I just ran out of hobnobs. But on the plus side, I found a great jungle ambient soundtrack for meditating. Anyway, it's approaching nightfall and I'd better find shelter quick. That was a close one. I've been in some dangerous scenarios, but nothing compares to the fresh food aisle of the local Tesco. Be warned, head to the shops and you take your life in your hands, leaving barely any room for avocados. Oh God, that got a bit hairy, but I've picked up some key supplies. You know what they say, never get between a panic buyer and the last tin of chickpeas. Uh, but if you find yourself panic buying, just lie down, stay very still, and rethink your life choices. Let's keep moving. If you're unable to hunt, you can certainly forage. These cupboards have been known to contain valuable sources of nourishment. If you know what to look for, it could save your life. Or better yet, kill 20 minutes. Oh, the heel. But in times like these, you've got to make sacrifices. This should keep me going until dinner, or until I get bored or peckish. Let's keep going. Nightfall brings a whole host of new challenges. If you've run out of things to watch, you may be forced to play board games, a fate worse than death. But even the safety of your bed comes with new challenges. You hear that? It's not a fox. It's my Italian neighbors on the balcony again. I'm all for a bit of camaraderie, but they're fucking awful singers. God, it's been a rough night. I've made it to the morning, and you can too. As long as we stay calm, keep busy, and use this time to do what we love, we should be just fine. Anyone for tea? Thanks very much for watching guys. If you enjoyed the video, please click like, leave a comment down below, but most importantly, subscribe to see all of my future sketches. I'm making loads this year, despite the global pandemic. Who thought I'd be saying that at the start of the year? Anyway, hope you're taking care of yourself. See you next week.